$10 million, that's how much the Kentucky Transportation Cabinet is spending on the Bardstown Road at Baxter Avenue area to make it safer for pedestrians. WDRB's Dakota Sherritt got a look at the recommended changes. Metro Public Works believes this investment will really help improve safety along the Bardstown Road corridor, particularly for tricky intersections like this one. This is Baxter, Bardstown, and Highland. You've got two lanes approaching you here and here and then then you've got lanes coming this way. Transportation Division Manager Dirk Cohen says this intersection was one of many flagged in Metro Louisville's 2018 Bardstown Baxter safety study. Looking specifically between Broadway and Eastern Parkway, there were hundreds of crashes between 2012 and 2017. Dozens of those incidents involved pedestrians. When you have the lighting configuration that we have out here, uh, combine that with a little bit of alcohol and pedestrians and we have a lot of crashes out here that we'd like to like to eliminate. Some of the things the upcoming roadway reallocation project may change include curb extensions, removing reversible lane assignment lights and changing from four lanes to two driving lanes to increase parking spots. Which is a, a, a safety improvement that should result in a crash reduction of about 25 percent. Special intersections like at Baxter, Bartstown and Highland may get their own solutions. In this case we might look at extending a nose out there on the intersection so that there's a refuge island in the center and making those crosswalks just cross Baxter and then cross Bardstown instead of crossing all of them in one sweep. The Kentucky Transportation Cabinet will make the final recommendations and designs. It's something that we, we've been requesting for some time. Public Works believes design plans will be done around January of next year, with work likely starting next summer. In Louisville, Dakota Sherrick, WDRB News.